So the Sierra trial is the first randomized phase three study comparing a transplant treatment using a radioiodinated antibody to ablate the marrow compared to conventional chemotherapy. So it's a randomized comparison and that's never been done before. It's specifically designed for patients who are over age 55 and who have recurrent or relapsed leukemia. Um, that puts them in a very challenging group who are difficult to treat by chemotherapy or other methods. What makes this trial unique is that it allows older patients to undergo a transplant that is potentially curative. Because it's a randomized trial, there's a coin toss at the beginning where some patients immediately get the new experimental treatment and others are given assigned to a standard treatment. What makes this trial different though is that patients are not stuck with their final choice. If they are randomized to being treated with conventional therapy and the conventional therapy is not working, the trial allows for a crossover to patients to receive the experimental treatment as well. So it's, um, it's designed as to be a kinder, gentler way of allowing everyone a shot at getting the experimental treatment. I'd want fellow hematologists to know that such a trial exists, that just because their patient is 58 or 60 uh, who appears to have recurrent leukemia, that that is not time to throw in the towel. That's the time to refer them for participation in the Sierra IMAB trial.